China just released their mind-blowing text-to-video AI tool, and it's really spectacular. To give you an idea, I'm going to show you guys some quick clips, and then we'll get into it. Kling is an AI video generator that was developed by Kuaishio Technology, a major Chinese technology company that was launched in 2011 with its headquarters in Beijing. This same company is behind the popular app Likey. This video generator is similar to Sora, but word around says that it's better in some areas. For one, it can generate high quality and realistic videos just from text prompts. And for what it's worth, it is open access which means everyone can get their hands on it and see the magic it can perform. To illustrate, a prompt says, a Moroccan man eating pizza at a table. Using Kling, we see it generate a video that looks too good to believe. So instead of setting up cameras, actors, and rigorous time spent in editing, you simply type out what you want to see, the setting, characters, actions, and overall vibe. Clean can generate up to two minute long videos with just a single prompt in full 1080p resolution at 30 frames per second, which is intriguing. This AI model understands physics and complex motion better, accurately creating videos that don't just look good, but behave like real-world videos. You see, that video was purely generated by Kling. Impressive? So take a guess. What features do you think it might have? All right, smash that like button and let's see the jaw-dropping features of Kling. When it comes to video quality, Kling AI sets a high standard that is on par with professionally produced videos from a live camera. Kling's advancement in body reconstruction technology helps capture the full expression of characters, making videos look so lifelike. Kling allows you to generate extended videos up to two minutes long. The videos are packed with detailed scenes and action. One of Kling's most impressive features is its advanced natural physics simulation for movement. If you go through Kling's website, you will see some of their demo videos. And I must say, these demos are pretty impressive. Is it the video of a man riding a horse in the Gobi Desert during sunset? Or a kitty driving a car through a busy urban street? The characters and objects behave just like in the real world, with no awkward robotic movements. These videos showcase the model's ability to handle multiplex scenes while maintaining high quality. Kling has the ability to create ultra-realistic 3D character models by reconstructing faces and bodies. The AI model employs a unique 3D variational autoencoder, a VAE, for face and body reconstruction, therefore enabling a detailed expression and limb movement from a single full-body image. On top of that, this technology is enhanced by a 3D spatio-temporal joint attention mechanism. Okay, easy peasy. What that does is it allows a model to simulate complex scenes like the way it would be in the real world. Back then, we saw a Moroccan man eating pizza. This technology enabled the video to express the full emotions of pleasure, satisfaction on the man's face, body movements, and even the restaurant settings. They all just look right. Altogether, the combination of these advanced 3D technologies results in videos that are not only visually stunning, but also highly realistic and common.
How does Kling stack up against other AI video generation models like OpenAI's Sora? For one thing, more video length. As stated earlier, Kling produces two-minute videos while Sora only generates a one-minute video. When it comes to resolution, Kling has a 1080p high definition, whereas Sora's is unspecified. This remains for frame rate. While Kling's is 30 FPS, Sora's remains unspecified. And physics realism is not left out. Kling is stronger and Sora is weaker. It's so obvious Kling has an edge over Sora, especially when it comes to longer video lengths, higher resolution, and realistic physics simulation for movement. This competitive edge underscores China's rapid advancements in AI video generation, positioning Kling AI as a formidable rival in the global market. Kling opens up amazing potential uses across various industries, from marketing to education and more. For example, filmmakers could use it for prototyping scenes and animations, thereby saving cost and a higher production rate. For marketers, it serves as an opportunity to create personalized product explainer videos to customers. This has been the goal of marketers, but due to cost, they stuck to a video that speaks to hundreds and thousands of customers at once. With Kling, marketers would seamlessly create a personalized video just a prompt away. In the education sector, educators can develop interactive training and learning videos according to the learner's capabilities. Social media influencers can produce fun, viral video content that resonates with their fan base. Surpassing many of its competitors, including OpenAI's anticipated Sora model, Kling AI leverages advanced 3D reconstruction technology to create vivid, lifelike videos that are up to two minutes long, thereby setting a new standard in AI-driven video creation. As Kling and AI video technology evolves further, we may see advanced AI-generated videos become mainstream for all kinds of personal and professional content creation. While ethical guidelines are necessary, Kling represents an exciting leap in easy, fast, and accessible video-making capabilities through the power of AI. This whole thing makes it so clear that China is seriously stepping up its game when it comes to AI development. But the big question remains whether China will make it accessible to the whole world. As it stands, you can only access via the app with a Chinese phone number. So what's your take on Kling? Do you think it's superb and incredible? Or just random AI models that would deplete as time goes on? Let us know in the comments section. Mind you, we upload videos on the latest trends in AI. To be updated and stay on top of your group conversation, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to ring the notification bell.